society to learn as much as I possibly can every year about healthcare, and particularly recently with all of the changes in healthcare, this is a great place to come and not only learn about issues from the experts, but talk to many other experts who are here. We have 82 different speakers, including the governor-elect, who from election day to inauguration day is making only one public appearance. And that is here with you this afternoon. This is the perfect state to be in, and you are the perfect people to work with. One of the reasons is that we just have a very progressive, visionary community here in healthcare. We do lead the, the country in a lot of different ways today. So we got great partners to work with in this state, and I want to ask you to help me in a lot of different ways. This is a great conference. I was here last year and was fortunate enough to be on a panel last year. It was a great opportunity to network with a lot of different people in the healthcare industry. This is a terrific opportunity to really get the insider's perspective on how healthcare reform is transforming all of the system and the impact it's having on the specific practitioners within that system. So I think it's really useful. I'm going to probably talk to a lot of folks about this conference. It's grown over the last couple years into something that's huge. The breakout sessions have been really good and the information that's here, it's amazing. I think the governor is, in a way, it's a wonderful position because I think a lot of change is driven by the situation and I think we're at a place, our own fiscal cliff related to healthcare in Washington where we cannot sustain the type of status quo that we currently have in place. What should Washington do? Go for the whole enchilada. Do not be seduced by incrementalism. Talk to those who have actually done it and then focus on the big issues first. Don't focus on the little stuff because the little stuff is not going to get you there. It's the big issues that are going to get you there. Is there a particular way that you would suggest people communicate with your transition or, or a new administration? Is there a point of contact on healthcare in particular? Well, DJ, you're a great point of contact to start with. DJ has been extremely helpful to me in the last year and a half developing our ideas on healthcare and, and I hope you might continue to receive information and get it to me in that regard. Uh -huh. so